Piers Morgan has slammed the husband of Sir Elton John, David Furnish, for his gutless response to questions raised regarding J.K. Rowling's stance on transgender issues, in his tell-all Sky News interview. Piers Morgan has called out David Furnish for saying he doesn't approve of J.K. Rowling's views on transgender issues. In conversation with Sky News' Beth Rigby, David spoke about the Harry Potter author and stated that he doesn't like any community to be singled out or stigmatized. Rowling has previously been criticized for her views and the discussions she has conducted regarding gender identity. Ahead of the full interview with David, a clip of the conversation has been posted via Sky News' official Twitter account which Piers has picked up and commented on. Retweeting the conversation clip to his 8.4 million followers, the broadcaster wrote, What a gutless response, basically telling J.K. Rowling to shut up and stop defending women's rights. Piers then went on to lash out at David's husband, Sir Elton John. In the interview, David stated that he had compassion and love for all. He said he had a tremendous admiration for what J.K. has done with Harry Potter. The Canadian filmmaker said that the fantasy author has helped so many children rediscover the joy of reading and has brought families together with the Core 7 book series. However, the father of two went on to say, I don't like to see any community singled out or stigmatized and I think when you have a platform like she has, if I was in her shoes I would direct it towards doing what I do best which is bringing people together. Elsewhere in the interview, David admitted that he has only met Rowling once, and has never, had the conversation with her about it. However, he believes that the author, obviously feels quite strong about it. I don't agree, I don't approve, he continued. But that's not my decision to make. Despite JK strongly denying any accusations of transphobia, Harry Potter franchise stars such as Daniel Radcliffe Emma Watson and Eddie Redmayne have all publicly opposed Rowling's views on gender reform.